It is time for our segment for the culture. It's Teacher Appreciation Week. All week we're talking about the unique struggles teachers have been facing in this pandemic. Well, this morning a local teacher gets really honest about how racial injustice made this year even tougher for teachers of color. Here's Wake Up Charlotte's Billie Jean Shaw. Good morning and happy Cinco de Mayo. Carlo Dawson, an English teacher at South Point High in Rock Hill, is entering her 20th year in education, a milestone that is marked by the headstone of normalcy as she once knew it. It's definitely been a balancing act, just trying to uh, be there for my students and be there for my children. Her teaching style involves movement and a hands-on approach, but throughout the last year, she has struggled with the limitations of virtual learning and connecting with students who need it the most. I've seen where um, a lot of times my African-American males um, have had the toughest time um, and we've known through research, usually those students are kinesthetic learners. Kinesthetic means students who learn through movement. Another challenge, carrying the weight of not only the fear of the virus, but the heaviness of the racial injustices that have spread over the country the last year. Dawson has served as an advisor for multiple diversity and inclusion events and organizations on campus, which has all come to an end due to virtual learning. As an educator of color, she continues to feel that responsibility and is turning to creative ways to promote a safe space for her students. I've had students who literally said, hey, Ms. Dawson, um, can you hang on a bit so I can talk to you about what's happening? I've lost my family members. Um, I have even had a student talk to me about um, coming out um, to his family. This is just a glimpse into the everyday struggles Dawson and other teachers alike are battling, but somehow they've aced the test of problem solving during the pandemic. And for that, Dawson says every single educator should be rewarded. Wouldn't it have been great if all the districts gave every single teacher teacher of the year this year? Um, the teacher of the year recognition because teachers have done a lot. I'm Billie Jean Shaw and that's For the Culture.